Kepu Savo walks as much as he can every day. Right now I'm just like focusing on getting my health up, like getting me back to work. That's because he was in the hospital for four months. I thought I was really healthy because I was out moving, working, doing everything on my own. Like, I didn't really think that I had a heart problem because my, throughout my whole life, I never did have one. He first thought it was just a cold, but he was short of breath and got tired all the time. Then doctors found out he had lost most of his heart function. He's only 29 years old. Unfortunately, it's an all too common issue. Um, there are about a half a million new cases of heart failure diagnosed every year in the U.S. alone. Many people think of heart failure as a disease of the elderly, and it turns out that there are many younger patients, both male and female, who suffer from heart failure. In Kepu's case, he had to wait for a heart transplant at UW Medical Center Montlake. While there, he found out two of his friends died from heart issues. I almost gave up until I talked to my grandma, and she was like telling me, like, you gotta hang on. You'll be fine. And then like a week later, when I was in the hospital, we found out that she has lung cancer. So and I was like, you know what? I'm, a, I'm not gonna let my grandma bury me. That's what kept me going, was, was fighting for my grandma. Right before Christmas, his fight paid off. I literally see life in a different, different way now compared to before. With a new heart and a new start. Even in the littlest thing, I appreciate it. He's absolutely determined to get better, so he can focus on the ones who supported him every step of the way. Being in the hospital it like made me think like how precious life is, and the ones around you that you hold close to your heart. Family is more important than anything. From the UW Medicine Newsroom in Seattle, I'm Katie Chen.